this will explain the predictions that I made, which I think I probably would have got correct. And it's an established piece of research in educational psychology, something captured in the serial position curve that you're looking at here. When people are presented with around 16 bits of information, it's not just the number of bits that are remembered between five to nine, which is working memory uh, capacity, but there's qualitative differences. We tend to remember the first bit. It's called a primacy effect. And this has its basis in our evolution. It's a survival mechanism. When we're confronted with a new stimulus, we're going to take in a lot of information and decide how best to respond to it. After that, you can see in the curve that there's a drop off in retention. And then suddenly there's a bit of a bubble in the middle called the von Restorff effect. Well, that's named after the psychologist who invented it. And quite simply, when the, there is a new stimulus, particularly a novel stimulus, the brain will kick in and our um, memory will pick up very quickly. And finally, at the end of an experience, we tend to remember taking a bit more information than normal, and that's called a recency effect. Now, if you apply these to, say, an interview situation, what you say and do very early on in the interview is important. The ability to show that you stand out, the von Restorff effect, and that last impression, a very powerful factor, and that's well researched that people who seem to be able to work this, um, um, are more successful. Now let's apply it to teaching. When you go into a new class, you've got a primacy effect. So what you do in that first couple of minutes may determine your whole experience with that group for the rest of the session, perhaps the rest of the time that you deal with them. Um, it's often been said, if you have a bad first class, then the second one is going to be a lot tougher. And that may go on and on. So think very carefully about what you do in those first couple of minutes in your session. Now, the von Restorff effect, if you can bring in interesting, novel, obviously meaningful activities, um, examples, it's going to have a better impact on attention. And how you finish, key summaries, key things that you say make a big difference. So there's a little bit of the science of learning.